Hey guys, this is Cloud Kitsune. We're back for some more Pokemon Detective Pikachu. Uh, yes. And off we go. <laughs> this is Chapter 2, which. Litwick Cave! Oh my god. I have never played this chapter. FYI. <laughs> Pikachu and I left Baker's. Baker. Baker? Detective Agency and headed to my dad's apartment. Yeah, I've only played chapter one. Wow, wow. Wow, wow. That doesn't look right. So, this <laughs> is my dad's apartment. Yeah, it was my apartment too. We shared it. I haven't been here in two months. Well, that would explain all the dust. <laughs> Why yeah, am I a black I mage? Guess you're right. It is a little bit of a mess, isn't it? What happened? He was like this at home, too. He called it an organized mess, and he knew where everything was. <laughs> That's what they all say. So, tell me, what are you gonna do now? I don't know. I'm guessing you don't plan on giving up the search. Of course not. Well, normally I would say that you probably should give it up. <laughs> no way. Relax. I'm gonna look for him with you. Yeah? I've been looking for Harry long before you came along. But it's gonna be a dangerous journey. So prepare yourself. Okay. Good, that's done. Now, since we'll be roommates, why don't we lay down some rules? Roommates? You can't just move in with me like that. Who's talking about moving in? This happens to be my apartment. If anyone's a freeloader, it's you. Oh, well, if you're gonna put it that way. Right. So it's settled then. Now let's start by searching right here. Oh, sure. How in the world did I get myself talked into this? Uh, Baker said that Dad was in the middle of investigating some Pokemon incident. Yeah. Well, let's start at the beginning. Maybe there's still notes in this room with the info that Harry was gathering. That's right. Dad must have found some clues and written stuff down. Let's look around. Yeah. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Why? Why am I black? <laughs> and not even the right black. I'm I'm just shaded. Like a freaking black mage. Oh my god. Uh <laughs> I I don't know if I could fix this actually. Uh, I'll, I'll be right back. <laughs> Boy. Okay, we're back. And apparently it's just closing and reopening it worked. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck. Unfortunately, we can't really see that scene. So, uh... Tim is just gonna be a black mage for the start. Don't worry about it. First, let's give the room a once-over. Right. Oh, and before I forget, if you think there's something in particularly important among the info we gathered today, you should write it down on its own page in your case list. Yeah, I did. I sorted out all the important info and put it on a special page. Hey, good job. I'm glad you're thinking ahead. Remember, it's important to go over your notes from time to time. Make sure you keep all your info we gathered organized like that. All right. Oh, listen to that music. I like it. It's good. Anyway. <laughs> Alright, let's look around. Receipts and notepads, some sweets. Looks like he ha was keeping track of his expenses. I can definitely understand wanting something, or some sweets around to keep you going. I feel bad. I got some chocolate covered cherries in my room. Like a huge tub of it. <laughs> so I was like, hmm, do I feel like sweets? I got it. <laughs> I rarely eat them though, but they're there, they're there. There's a uh, receipt card posted here. It's my mom's writing. The refrigerator is empty. Where is your mom? We should go grocery shopping. Probably. The dishes are all left as is, but the coffee maker is as clean as a whistle. So he couldn't make coffee when he needed it, no doubt. All right. TB. Wait, is that? A TV. Dad only watched the news. This place has a lot of stuff too. A dictionary, novels, food magazines, and a healthy supply of sweets. 
The TV is switched off. I guess he didn't watch it much. I mean, he wasn't here. I would hope it would be turned off when he left. This carpet is the one we used back home. He said he liked the design, but it was getting beat up. I thought he had thrown it out. The design is nice, but it also has nice, a nice touch to it, too. I'd say I like this carpet. Yeah, you can see, like, holes in it. Um... Pants he left on the floor. There's a receipt to a cafe in one of the pockets. It's from the High Hat Cafe. Looks like he went there almost every day. Well, but at least we know what he liked. I wonder if he... <laughs> it's coffee, sweets. <laughs> cafe. I wonder if he was about to do laundry. There are shirts and underwear stuff like this. I say that's about a week's worth of clothes. I guess he didn't even have time to do it for laundry. Hmm. There's a jazz records. There are jazz records here. My dad had listened to them whenever he needed to think about things. Wow, he certainly has a good taste in music. I mean, yeah, I, I do enjoy jazz. Hey. No. <laughs> no, Pikachu. I am looking. A disorganized jumble of records, magazines, and books. Hmm? This door won't open. It seems like it's locked. How strange. Is there a key somewhere around here? We've checked just about everywhere, but no clues and no key. I guess we'll have to take an even closer look. But seriously, the state of this room. It's a mess. Yeah, Dad was always like this, but he would always say he knew exactly where everything was. I mean, okay, fair fact, fair fact, uh, fun fact. <laughs> There, there is some kind of order in disorderly messes like this. Like, you as a person who may have a messy room knows exactly where everything is. And I am one of those type of people. <laughs> I have, like, an organized mess where things are where they should be. But if someone moves things out of place, like, I know. I know where it should have been. Where'd, where'd you move it? <laughs> hmm. It doesn't do us any good if only Har Harry... I almost said Harley knows where things are. Can you think of anything else? Um, Harry at home in Pikachu hat. Pikachu, did my dad give that, you, give that hat to you? Yeah, I don't remember, but Baker said it as much. Any case, any chance there's a key in there? Good point. I hadn't thought of that. Let's see. Bad news? Nothing. Can you think of anything else? Um, <laughs> if it was me. Let's see. Harry at home. Harry has it. Let's try Harry at home. Uh, when dad was back home, what did he do? Figured it out from his past actions, huh? You're starting to think more like a detective. Oh, now that I think about it, dad always hid his valuable things in food containers. <laughs> Really? In food containers? Yeah, there was one time he stuck a key to the back of a sugar pot. My mom was pretty surprised when she found it. Food, huh? Was there something like that here? Uh, the container of food? Sweets? Hmm. I thought I saw something somewhere. Let's have another look around the room. My first thought was up here, because hey, there, there's a, there's a this. Yeah. This jar. It's my dad's favorite candy. I wasn't sure what it was when I saw the jar. But, uh, yeah, apparently it's, it has some use. Look at that castle. Uh, we got him a jar for his birthday from the whole family. I remember visiting a bunch of stores, but nobody seemed to have it. Yeah, I don't recall seeing this before. Here, give me one. Are they jelly beans? Acting selfish again, huh? Hmm. Something on the base. I found it, but you the key. Of course. This would be the best place to hide it. Come on, let's get the doors on that shelf open. Got a key. Sorry, I, I've been ignoring Pikachu wanting to talk to me. <laughs> Let me instruct you on some detective tips. Hi. Ready? No. Detective tip number 33. Look, seeing and observing are not the same. 
All right, cool. <laughs> All right, let's unlock this. I hope it has some glue. Me too. Could this be? Paper. Pikachu, I think I found some notes. Really? <clears throat> Let me see. That are scribbles. Yeah, this definitely is. Good work, Tim. I'd say we're hot on Harry's trail now. <clears throat> Hooray! Harry's notes. One shows some kind of relationship diagram, but it doesn't do us any good if we can't figure out what the symbols mean. What's the other piece of paper? It looks like a map. It has some marks on it. The layout is of this area. This is a map of R Rhyme City, and the area is marked. There were the incidents that Harry was investigating happened. You're right, but this area over here has marks too, although only one place has an incident. That mark, it's different from the rest, and the incident happened after Harry went missing. Which means... My dad predicted where an incident was going to occur and marked it that seems likely the remaining three marks for the warehouse a lake and litwick cave that's about all we can tell from this we'll have to cover them one at a time good idea let's get to <laughs> uh, there's got to be something we can find out if we go to these places right let's head out tim yeah we decided to first head to the cave my dad had marked. Saving. Hopefully the game loads properly this time. <laughs> it's gonna be a black mage again. <coughs> ah! Drifloon! Hmm. Amelia, we need to run, but my hey, leg! There's someone here. Why are they here? Yeah, and it sounds like something's going on. <coughs> oh. Come on, let's go! Pikachu! Thunderbolt! He can't! Hey, don't boss me around! Unfortunately, I can't use moves ever since the accident. What? Blah, blah, blah. Let's just get its attention. Okay. Defeat the blah, blah, blah. A good good throw. Ha! I was prepared this time. <laughs> Hi. Uh-oh. He's my ass. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think we'll be able to win by fighting it. What should we do? Look. Oh. You ready? Let's go. Yeah. What are we doing? Jesus Christ. Sounds like an angry old man. Are we gonna kill it? Oh, well, at least as hard as a rock is fine. Great job, Tim. Thanks. Oh, uh, pressing the button a lot. Aha! This should take care of you. Get out of here! I don't like your face. <laughs> See you later, Glalie. Did it, Tim. I like Laylee. Now, to help the ladies. Hmm. They're fine. Mako Okamoto. You okay? Hmm. That face. I think so. Oh my, god. my friend here, she's hurt her leg. No, I'm fine. Uh, oh. Oh, hey, don't push it. Thank you for helping us. My name is Mako. And this is I had a like very brief moment that I thought the brunette, the short-haired lady, was Thank speaking uh, oh. Pikachu's voice actor. Hey, don't <laughs> I was like, I that's a deep the... voice oh, yeah, for the lady. In front of the station. Uh, really? You two know each other? Don't He's point the one who got her eye out. Back in that Apom incident. Ah, oh, so that was you, huh? Uh huh. My name is Tim Goodman. My name's Amelia. Hello. And hello, Pikachu. Amelia. What a nice name. So happy to see you again. You know. Nice to meet you. I'm Mako. <laughs> Aren't you a lively girl? <laughs> She's a oh, woman. Oh, it's a news camera. Have you ever seen one? We came to this cave to shoot some news coverage. 
Are you from a TV station? Yep, that's right. The super popular GNN. Never heard of it. Hey, Tim. Do you think you could help us out the way you did with that Michael, necklace? stop! Huh? You can't drag the... <sighs> oh... Uh, uh, I'm afraid she's really hurt. We need to get her out of this cave now. Alright. Uh, in this cold, we'll freeze before any help gets here to us. It's cold in here? Oh, look at the little wind! Look at over there! Ah. The interest has collapsed, but we'll see if there's some way we can get out. Thank you. Be careful, okay? Uh, first we should check out the collapsing entrance. Yeah. Escape from the cave! Alright. Uh, alright. <laughs> Let's first confirm the situation. It's first important to look around. Stuck at the cave. All right. No, let me let me do the thing. Hi. Hey, what's this? Hey, Tim, check out the entrance. But but, wait a second, Tim. What do you want? <laughs> how? We're checking the entrance, right? Exactly. But how are we going to do any checking if it's so dark? Litwicks, they're right there. Hmm. But I don't have anything useful, and I, and you can't do any moves, right? This is where you need to use your brain. Is there anything at all we could use for light? Litwicks, right here. Hmm? That'd be a Litwick. I've seen them around back home. Very perceptive. Hey, Tim. Hey, Litwicks. Wake up, will ya? Are they sleeping? Wake, wake. Look at them! Oh, I love Litwicks. Litwick. Oh. Whoa. That's a deep voice for that one. I didn't know they had two different voices. Huh. I want the one with the deeper voice. <laughs> wow. I didn't realize that Litwick's flame was this bright. Yeah, it should be easier to investigate now. I have a Litwick plush. It's um, a Halloween one from Pokemon Center. <laughs> I wish they made the Chandelier one. Um, but they've only done the first two forms. For Halloween, and I, I hope this year or last year they were gonna do it, but they didn't. But I got a Whimsicott instead, so I still won. <laughs> still, I got something good. Also, I got um, a Drifloon, and um, uh, what's the one dark fox Pokemon? Um, Zork, the baby form. Yeah, also, there's a Halloween version of that, which I also have. So, I like Halloween, and I like Pokemons. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I hope this year they come out with something, though. Because then I could have, like, a complete set of my favorite fire candle Pokemon. For sure, I'm keen to find clues about my dad. Right. There's, uh, that's one of the reasons we need to find a way out. Yeah, let's check out the entrance. Let me look! Is that a stick? Maybe this was a sign to guide people. It's broken now. Only the stick is left. Okay. It's blocked by some rocks. There are some gaps here and there, but it's not big enough for a person to get through. What about okay, Pikachu? We'll be in trouble if it collapses. So let's find another way out. Alright. Oh. There must be uh that must be a piece of the rock we dropped. It's really pointy. Hello. It's lovely, Pikachu. Hey, wake up! Wake, wake. Just five more minutes, you say? I think it's still half asleep. It's natural to be sleepy at night. Let's come back later. It can't be helped. Alright. Okay. I'm fine. Please don't worry about me. Um. Let's see. About the injury. Is your leg okay? Yes, as long as I keep it like this, it doesn't hurt. It seems like I'm always causing you trouble. Oh, don't worry about it. Just rest here, Amelia. You've got to show her that we can be counted on, eh, Tim? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh... What were you trying to shoot here? You were trying to make a report about what kind of place it is. It's really, really a family oriented tourist spot, but recently it's become popular as a dating spot among couples, too. We thought we could be, uh, we could introduce it on our show. How about you, Tim? 
Why did you come here? I'm looking for my dad. <laughs> oh, uh, just sightseeing, you know, since I'm new to town. Oh, I'm sorry to get you caught up in all of this when you were just trying to have a good time. It's not your fault, Amelia. Let's get out of here together. Alright. Hey, Tim! Tim! What? I was gonna talk to the other lady. Hey, look up! Hmm? What do you mean, up? The hole? That we made? <gasps> it's night time! So we have an exit right there, we just need to drop a rope. The moon! The ceiling is open! Maybe we can get a flying Pokemon to carry us. Oh, actually, that's a better idea than I was thinking. <laughs> Good. Yeah, a bunch of different Pokemon have settled here. So there must be a flying Pokemon here, right? Alright. Let's first... Uh, first, let's get some info on the Pokemon here in the cave. Right. You're getting the hang of this. It's hard to search for in the dark. First, we need to get our bearings. Oh. Now... It's time to get moving, huh? So no Aww. more dawdling. Aw. But I like to dawdle. You want to know what sort of Pokemon are in the cave? I researched that before the shoot, so you can count on me. First we got Litwick, right? And then... Uh, what was it? Mako... Oh, I know. We can tell what Pokemon are here from the footage we just took. Oh, good idea. Okay, let's get to it. Ah, the battery is dead. It's fine, I got a backup. Huh? Oh no, my bag is gone. The one with the equipment to wear the shoot in it? Oh, I remember. I borrowed it a little while ago. And left it by the sign at the entry. Oh, you son of a bitch. The battery's in it. Okay. Okay, then. We'll go... We'll look for the bag. Really? Thanks. I mean, what else can we do? What we need is a Pokemon that knows how to fly. I know. Let's check the footage Mako shot. Maybe we'll see one on that. Mm-hmm. That's the goal. Okay, let's find that bag pronto. Um... It was the same place, blah, blah, blah. Let's walk by some rocks. Um, said it was by the entrance, but I don't... Oh, I wonder if Galia's move caused it to collapse. Yeah, it's definitely... A, was it holding back? Um, oof. <laughs> Sorry. Oof. <laughs> move the rock. I think you can move this. <gasps> there it is. Gotta go from above first. And then get the smaller stuff. Um, can I just grab it from here? Here it is, the bag. All right, it's that easy. Little no way. Quick, quick. Know anything about this cave? Quick, quick. Oh, you have a lot of buddies. To so it's fun. After all, it is Lootwick's cave. Cool. I found the bag. Thank you. This should be have... What do we need? Second time's a charm. Let's watch the video. Alright, Tim. Let's check out that footage. Make sure to keep your eyes open for any flying Pokemon. <sighs> Look for anything that'll help us escape. Right. Good evening, everyone. This is one of Ryan's videos. Here we are, spot. reporting without Let a clue. Cave. Yeah. And the reason this cave is hey, so popular... Something weird going on. Look, it's mood huh? changed. Yeah. Its eyes changed color, then it attacked us. It completely lost control of itself. I've never seen a Glalie like this before. They are flying Pokemon. They're Drifloon. Yeah, but they're barely strong enough to lift up a child. I really don't think they'll be able to help get us out. If Drifloon can't help us, I don't know that we have any other options. <laughs> it's attacking everything it sees. <laughs> Drifloon got frozen solid. Oh, my leg! I can't fall! Amelia! Are you okay? <sighs> Here's where I thought we were definitely done for. Yeah, but thanks to you, we're safe, Tim. Oh, no need to think. Oh, you're talking to Tim. 
<laughs> Why is the quality so cruddy? That Pokemon in the back is flying, isn't it? Yes, it's a drip blim. I bet it could carry us. Perfect. Good eye, Tim. We may have our ticket out of here. Drift blim. I like that one too. Dude, I love Drifloon and Driplim. <laughs> the great Pokemon. Yeah, Driplim. If we can get it to carry us, we should be able to escape through the hole in the ceiling. Alright, Tim. We need to find Driplim. It's gotta be here somewhere in this cave. We can get out if we just ask Driplum, right? Good. So let's go look for one. Alright, I love that little image of it though, it's so cute. Fuck, dude, I love Driflim. Will you open now? Hey, wake up! Oh, look at me. Wake up! Ah, I want it! Eewee! Aww. It's so cute! Good, it's awake. Maybe there are Litwicks deeper in the cave too. Yeah. I hope you can keep this up as we move ahead. <laughs> he looks so sad. I wonder if it's okay. It seems a lot calmer. Hey, get glally, get glally. Can you talk? Good. We should be. We should ask some questions. Why did you go on a rampage like that? Did someone make you angry? What? You don't remember anything? Huh? What is that supposed to mean? I don't know. It doesn't even remember going berserk. Um... What were you doing before you went berserk? Hello. It remembers watching Emily and Mako filming. So it's not like it, they did something wrong. Hello. Something fell down from the s from above? I wonder what that means. You seem really wiped out. Are you okay? Aww. Oh, so you are actually better now than you were a while ago. When you came to, you couldn't even move, huh? I wonder what happened to it. Gla gla. You want some water? We. It must be very thirsty. If we find some water, we'll bring it to you. Alright. Gotta give him some stuff. Hey, another little quick. Quick, quick. Eewee. Aww. God, I like this chapter already. <laughs> Just because, like, it's so cute. It's getting brighter even deep in the, within the cave. What the heck is that? A beautiful blue stone. Is this Drifloon? Glimes must have mo uh, move must have frozen it solid. Poor thing. Do you think it's okay? I'm sure it's fine. Why, it may even become <laughs> a new attraction for this cave. Uh, quit joking around. We need to help it. Hmm. So we need to melt the ice. Tim, carry it for me, would you? What am I doing with it? It's a baby. Where am I taking it? Litwick? Can you... Hmm, it's not even starting to melt. I guess we need a stronger flame. Maybe... two. Hard on me? There's two B here. Oh! How about these guys? Hey, can you lend us some warmth? Quick, quick. No, Drif I have Drifloom uh, plush as well, but it's just regular one. Awesome! It's totally melted. Drifloom, Drifloom. It says thanks. <laughs> it's so cute. You know anything about this cave? Drif, Drif. It says everything gets along well. It doesn't sound like it was in a fight that caused. Glally, Glally, to get so angry. All right, I think it was just a collateral. It got in the way. <gasps> They're up there. Hey, look, Louis, are there too. 
Yeah, I see them. Hey, Ludwig! It's no use. They can't hear us. I guess we need to get closer. Climbing up is impossible. We need to figure out a way to wake them up. Maybe the other Pokemon can help us out. Um, Drifloo! Can you wake him up? About that. We want... <laughs> hey, Pikachu! We want to wake up the Litwicks that are up high, deeper in the cave. Drift, Drift. Oh, you'll wake them up for us since we helped you. Thanks, Drifloon. Usually just drifts around. <laughs> God, I love their little hearts. I guess you could say I like a lot of ghost Pokemon. Yeah, we woke up the Litwick. Now we can search even deeper into the cave. Alright, let's go! Hard on me. Oh, they're little bats! I wonder how they get upside down here from here. They probably asked Grifflin or something. What? Noi, Noi bat. Noi. At home in the darkness. There are the three tunnels and three hanging Pokemon. That's Noi bat. Noi. Hey guys, have you seen Drift Bloom? Noi, Noi. What? That aside, you smell food? Huh? Ah, I still got a piece of candy in my pocket. Hey, Drifloon. <laughs> noi, noi. Noi. Noi! All three of these guys claim that Drifloon is in their tunnel. Each says, there, <laughs> they'll let us pass if you give them the candy. Huh? Are there really supposed to be that many Drifloons here? Nah, they're probably lying because they want the food. Let's gather a testimony to figure it out. Which one is telling the truth? Which tunnel is Driftbloom in? Blim. Not Bloom. Uh, hello. Hey, Ludwig is here! Ludwig! Wait. Oh, <laughs> he has a goofy voice. I like it. Oh, hey, there's a river. So, there's a river ahead. This is as deep as you can go, I think. Yeah. Is the water in this river drinkable? Oh yeah, we need water. Yeah, this water is famous. It's also good for making coffee, of course. In that case, let's get Glowly a drink. River water obtained. Alright. Part on me, part on me, ba 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 ba. Here, we brought you some water. Drink it slowly. Aww. Hey, there's some... Uh, that seems to have perked you up a bit. That's good to see. <coughs> oh, good. Um, let's see, what is this? About the Pokemon in the tunnel. Do you know anything? Claw. It doesn't seem... It doesn't know anything. Apparently, it's never been to the tunnels at all. I mean, it's too big. I guess Glally, 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 oh my god, I cannot say this one's name. <laughs> god damn it. Glally would have a hard time fitting into them. Alright, and... Well, are you feeling any better? Glaw. Glad to hear you've got your energy back. Glaw. It wants to help us out. I guess it feels responsible for what happened. That's a good Pokemon, isn't it? Glaw. It says it's really good at Ice Beam. Oh, that. Oh, could it refreeze the river? It definitely has. Imp was impressive. If we need some help, we'll definitely ask. And that's it there. What's the point of that stone? I want to know. Jeff, Jeff. Know anything? Jeff, Jeff. It says that they live in the hole next to the one Lewick use. Drifloon lives next to Litwick. Got it. Uh... We'll be able to find... Figure out a lot more if we can f find out which hole Litwick uses. Okay. Well, I would assume it's this one because they're all above him. But... 
Did you see anything? Uh, about the cave. You know anything about this cave? Look quick. It says there's no limit beyond this point. So they don't go beyond the river then. Is there anything you know? Look quick. It says no way back head out to look for food once the morning comes. Which is weird because like they're nocturnal. Don't you think they would leave at night? <laughs> Not in the day. Hmm. We can't wait until morning. Yeah, it was pretty solid. Alright. Do you know anything about this cave? Quick, quick. It says there are no bites ahead. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> it sounds like there are a lot of Pokemon living here. Do you know anything? Quick, quick. It says it can sleep peacefully in there because Doibat is always keeping watch. I see. I guess there are like a security guards for everyone here. Although it seems a piece of candy is enough to bribe them. Maybe they just felt like you and I were not here to cause trouble. Alright. So they're not bad. Quick, quick. What do you think about this cave? Quick, quick. It says you can see the stars from the hole and they they are beautiful. I guess that's the opening, the open ceiling. After all, it's supposed to be a good date spot. Quick, quick. It sounds like the legs don't like the cold, so they congregate to the far left hole. Far from the river. Meaning the drift plume is the one on the remaining tunnels? Yeah, that must be the case. And drift blooms or drift plume. Drifloon says that he sleeps, like, right next door. That must be a piece of the rock we dropped. It's really pointy. Alright. Quick work. Uh... Yeah, I already said this one. I didn't mean to click it. <laughs> ah, so you don't go deep into the cave too often. All right. Well, that that helped us at, not at all. Okay, so a rock. If I were to deduce, because Drift Bloom. Okay, uh, they they live here, so he's not in this one. I'm guessing Drift Lim, Drift Loon lives in this one, and then Drift Bloom would live in this one. Hey, quit it! Oh. Why are you trying to take me? Put me down! Oh. 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 I think he died a bit. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm, I'm guessing this one then. Noi! You know anything about this cave? Noi! I see. It's become more lively and it's fun for all different po uh, people. Huh? Guess for them, we're the show. Know anything? Noi. Noi, noi. Noi! It seems like each one of these tunnels is home to a different Pokemon, but each one of these Noabats insists that Dreadblood is in their tunnel. We're in a pickle. Yeah, but if we have even a little more information, we should be able to deduce where Drifloom is. If we can find out what it is in these whole other holes, then the remaining ones must belong to Drifloom, right? I understand now. So finding out about what other Pokemon are in which holes is also important. Alright, well I'm, I'm pretty sure it's this one, but let's talk to the others as well. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Do I think about the cave? No way. It says that nowadays people come here day and night, so it's hard to get a good sleep. Hmm, sorry about that. Noi! Noi, noi! Noi! It seems like each one of these tunnels is home to a different Pokemon, but each blah 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 blah. Okay, we already got that. Um, so let's talk to the last one. Noi. What do you know about this cave? Noi, noi! 
It says since people started coming here, they can find all sorts of unusual foods to eat. Hmm. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Oh, wait. Forgot to say the last thing. Uh, don't know, no. Yeah, it's, it's all the same. Alright. I stand now. So I've talked to everybody. Except for the. Hey! What? We've gathered some information. Open up the case notes and let's think about it. That's actually what it's about to do. But alright. <laughs> Let's take a look. Did you hear some testimony that tells you where Driplum is by any chance? Yes. Um. Okay. So. Uh, I believe this one is here. Do you think that's right? Yeah. And that looks there. I see. And that looks there. I okay. see. Which which one does it? Uh, when more comes, we'll go for food. Go the tunnel, all the way to the left. And then this one is thanks to it keeps peace in the tunnel. Okay, I think it's that one. And then I want to say, wait, what's this? The tunnels. I don't know about the tunnels. It's different. Oh, come on. Uh, that? Okay. You think that's right? I guess not. Uh, <laughs> no, that's not right. All right. Uh, oh, he says the tunnel's next to Litwick. Okay, thanks. No, I guess it's I, I do think it's this one. I see what you mean. Um, well, then what's the deal? And then that? Do you think that's right? Nope. Uh, Fuck. <laughs> no, that's not right. This this one was right over there, I right? See what you mean. Well, then what's the Maybe it's oh. this? Do you think that's what right? What the fuck? How do you do this one? I don't understand. No, that's not right. Cuz it's right next to Litwick, right? But maybe that one doesn't sleep then. Uh, we'll get there in the tunnel all the way to the left. But the left is, they don't move anywhere, do they? Or is it like this? No. <laughs> I don't know. No, that's not right. Me no understand. What am I doing? It is next to him though. Do you think that's right? Fuck off. Uh do about tunnels, each buddy different Pokemon. Unless it's I see what you mean. Well uh, what's the deal? Wait. Get food. Ah, uh, maybe it's here. I see. Cause they don't. Do you think that's right? No. <laughs> I really don't. <laughs> I don't know. No, that's not right. Do I just have to like guess every single one at this point? Cause like I have no fucking clue. Oh, uh, which was that one? That was the park cave. That's mm. peace. Bah. Do you think that's right? I think I already did that one the last time. No, that's not right. Ah. Uh... Do you think that's right? No. Do you think that's right? No. Do you think that's right? <laughs> I don't. <laughs> no, that's not right. I have no idea, dude. Cause I don't think this would be it, right? I see. I see what you mean. Do you think that's right? Nope. 
Oh my god. I don't even know which no, orders I've done so far. Right. Um. Why do I have a key again? Apparently hangs out. Hey, Pikachu. That's not what I wanted at all. Um. Alright, well. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, maybe he's over here instead. I don't know. I see. This? And then over here. Do you think that's right? No. Uh, <laughs> no, that's not right. Maybe he's in the center. I don't know. I see what you mean. Well, then what's the deal? No, this I is like. What... No, did I already do this one though? Do you think that's right? Yeah, I already did that uh, order. Okay. No, that's not right. <sighs> do you think that's right? N no. I see what you mean. I see what you mean. Well, then what's the di Do you think that's right? No. <laughs> Do you think that's right? Do you think that's right? When you say that, I think it's wrong. <laughs> Do you think that's right? Okay, whatever. <laughs> I don't know. No, I'm pretty sure I've already right. done that one, actually. Um. Oh, and then? Uh. I see what you mean. Well, then what's the deal? Do you think that's right? No. Mm. Do you think that's right? Fuck. I uh, I need to <laughs> I need to pay attention to what I'm no, doing here. Otherwise, right. we're gonna be stuck on this fucking puzzle forever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and then? Oh, and then? Do you think that's right? Nope. Uh, no, that's not right. Oh my god. Because, like, okay, my actual thought process was that the look was here. Oh, and, and then? Driftblin was here. But then, like the other one, I don't know. I would I think it'd be this one because of the food guy. I think that's right. But it's not the correct mm. order, so it's like, what the no, fuck? That's not right. Like, what? What do you mean? Oh, and then? Unless he's over here. I the, see. This guy's over here. Do you think that's right? Oh, fuck, I don't know. Mm. No, that's not right. Cause like, didn't they say the left ones I don't see. even? But like, I already did that one, didn't oh. I? Do you think that's right? No. Uh, no. That doesn't make any sense. Right. I am so confused right now. Cause like, that's. Oh. And then. <sighs> I see what you mean. Well, then what's the deal? I don't know. Do you think that's right? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm not paying attention. No, Looks like right. the Drifloons don't actually live in there. It's like it's just all these guys, oh, which I see what you that didn't make any sense. If that's, that's the case, right? yeah, it wouldn't make any fucking sense. No, that's not right. Because the left one said they don't stay over there, but then it's like the left is showing the water, not that's just the right side though. I'm so fucking confused. I don't get it. What the fuck am I doing? I see what you. Do you think that's No. That's <laughs> I'm just throwing shit up now. No, that's not right. I'm getting frustrated. Hold on, I don't give a fucking shit anymore. <laughs> Lit Wicks Cave Uh Entrance Location Um What are they called again? Noibat? Order. Uh, uh, uh. 
Because this is driving me batty. <laughs> oh! Okay, I think I understand now. See, I was confused by the point of the freaking bat. So the bat is like telling us where the actual thing is. And the drift loon was there, like I, I thought. And then well, I'm guessing this guy is here. Do you think that's right? No, it's not. Uh, what do you mean? No, okay, let's try again. Right. Maybe it's the wrong freaking Litwick. Cause the noy bat should be here. Uh, maybe it's this guy. Do you think that's Fuck, right? I don't know. Uh, no, that's not right. Okay, so it's the left one then. Do you think that's right? That makes no sense uh -huh. though. Do you think that's right? Ow! Right. And so, from those three accounts, we should be able to figure out which Pokemon is where. And we'll know which Pokemon is in each hole, which will be very helpful. That... What? How did that make any fucking sense? Okay, I think Drifloon Blue Bloom is there, he's here, and there's blah 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 there. That's my... Do you think that's right? That was my entire guess of what the order is. But like that, the why the left one though? That's the one on the far river who doesn't even sleep in one of those caves, right? Yes, that's exactly where Drifblum is. Fuck off. <laughs> <Let's tell Noibat laughs> and then speak what the to fuck? So I had like the right order in my brain. I was just using the wrong fucking Litwick because those are the ones that said they don't even live in the caves on the left fucking side of the cave. <laughs> I'm bad. <laughs> Fuck off. Here you go. You can have this. Noi noi. It says we can go through. I'll call... I'll go call Drift Bloom, so wait here. Right, be careful. To the walk. Hey, Drift Bloom, wake up. Ah! Goes with the wind. Yeah. I love it. I had one in a uh, shining pearl. I named it Purple Haze. <laughs> he was a good boy. That did the trick. Here comes Driplum. Drift. We did it. So Driplum, do you think you can get us out of this cave? Drift. That's right. Me and three people. Drift. What? The wind is too weak. Driplum. It says it can't rise up in the breeze like this. It needs a strong wind to get us there. How are we supposed to get that kind of wind? Oh, I'm sure we'll figure something out. We're getting closer to escaping. That's for sure. Sure. Well, we finally found Driftlum. Now if we can just get the wind to blow, we'll be able to get out of here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Alright. I don't. <laughs> Glaw. Glaw. Uh, we're gonna talk to him about everything. Okay. I'm fine. Please don't worry about me. We need a strong wind to escape. Do you know anything about that with the wind? It's only slight, but I do feel a breeze. I think it's coming from deeper in the cave. Oh, right. The deeper end could be dangerous, right? Please be careful. Huh? So there's hope for, to, uh, for an escape, after all. Um, what were you trying to shoot here? Uh, we were planning on introducing this cave as a cool place to visit, especially since the weather is starting to get hotter. I mean, it was my boss's idea, but still. Sounds like a fun show. Well, it's supposed to be just a light-hearted show, but we weren't expecting to get attacked by Glarely during filming. It's not the first time a Pokemon has suddenly gone berserk while we were doing a shoot. Is that so? Very interesting. I wonder what the cause could be. Buh -buh. Do you know where he, this kind of thing is happening? Not a clue. It's not like we're doing anything different. That's strange. Well, it's a scoop for us, so I'll consider it good luck. You're awfully positive about this whole thing. I wonder what happened to get Lily. We need a strong wind to get us out of here. 
could you tell me anything about the wind? Most caves have hidden passages, and sometimes that wind blows through those into the cave. But the hidden passages can be blocked by for a number or any number of reasons. I see. So if we can find one of those. Yeah, you might be able to get a strong wind blowing. Alright. So we just need to find one. What? I'm feeling a very slight breeze. But where could it be coming from? Your own mouth here, you're breathing. I mean, I would assume... Like, the entrance? Has some gaps here, blah blah blah. Maybe this is a signpost, blah 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 blah. Collapsed it. Yes, definitely holding something back. Burr, 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 burr. Do you guys know? Nope. Cool. Um. Just point that we dropped. What about you? Do you know nothing? You know nothing. A rock. What about you? Do you know burr, 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 breeze? Nope. Beautiful blue stone. Uh, nope. Hey, doesn't he go through the room? Oh, nope. Never mind. <laughs> I thought that he might have something. Um. Uh, huh? The wind is blowing from the back of the cave. Yeah, if this, uh, this wind gets a little stronger, Drift Bloom should be able to fly, right? You're right, but even if we want to investigate, we can't because of this river. Finding a solution is to that will be fun, eh? Sure. <laughs> oh, of course. Just as would be expected from a great detective. I guess we j should talk to Driftblim and Amelia and Mako too. Alright. Hey, Tim. What? Don't get fall. Tim, got a water bottle? Are you thirsty? Uh, thanks. Jesus Christ. If you make coffee with this water. Oh my god. You would be out of this world. <laughs> now is not the time for that. <laughs> We're going to freeze to this, apparently. Uh, about this cave. I think you know about this cave. Drift. It says there were have been more people here recently. This must be a pretty popular spot, although I guess it's only us here at this time of night. Do you know anything about the river at the end of the cave? Yeah. It says it can get past the river. It can't get past the river because of the head of wind. I see a headwind, huh? Alright. Okay. Okay, please don't worry about me. Uh... I do feel the wind from deeper in the cave, but there's a river in the way, and we can't cross it. That's a problem. How wide is the river? It looks like it could be more than 16 feet. I see. Jumping over it would be difficult. It's- I'm more of a thinker than an athlete. Alright. Good for you, Pikachu. Huh? So, let's hope for escape after all. I feel the wind blowing from beyond the river, but... You don't know how to cross it. Oh wait, can't we use ice beam? Do you think swimming is a bad idea? Uh, in freezing cold temperatures, yes. Of course it is, you'll freeze. River water is in caves like this is really cold. Glalie. Hey, oh, maybe I have to talk to Pikachu first? My body's getting stiff. Therefore... I do aerobics. I thought it you said... helps me relax and clears my head. Uh, I guess you don't have to do be an athlete to be. Can you please? All right. Well, what the fuck do you have to do? Hey, Tim. What? Tim. So I didn't have to cross this river. Well, I was thinking Glalie because ice freeze the river. We could freeze it and walk across. Hmm. That might just work. It looks like Glalie has had a chance to recover a little. Maybe we should go ask it for help. Right, let's go. 
Finally! <gasps> Skipping a step is what I was doing. <laughs> Glalie, we actually have something to ask of you. Sorry to bother you when you're still weak. Do you think you could help us out? We want to cross that river and we're wondering if you could freeze it with your ice beam. Cool! Wow, great! It says it can do it. Bop. Alright, we're counting on you, Glalie. Claw! Jesus Christ. I'm <laughs> so tired. Whoa. Claw. Okay. You'd best get some rest by the looks of it. Thank you, Glalie. Take it easy for a while. Claw. Now we should be able to cross. Take care that you don't slip. Aw, oh, but that's the fun part. Hey, Tim! Tim! On the ice? Yoo-hoo! I'm the great Detective Pikachu! 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 Alright. <laughs> Tim, go ahead and shout something too. It's really fun. No, thank you. <laughs> I'm more interested in getting out. <laughs> breeze. Here, wind is blowing out of this small hole. Oh, this is nice. If we can break down the wall and make the hole bigger, I bet we'll get a stronger wind. Break down? You mean this rock? Yeah. Tell me how you think we could do it. Um... <laughs> dig with hands. Make a... Make a tool to dig with. Ask you know, he's too tired. Gotta make a tool. How about making a tool? Oh, wait, that's what the rocks and stick are for, probably, right? I see. What kind of tool? Since we'll be digging, maybe a shovel? Or a pickaxe? Uh, we're going to have to make it here. Do you think that we'll be able to find the materials for a shovel? Oh, good point. You're really keeping an eye out <laughs> on your surroundings, aren't you, Pikachu? Of course I am. I'm the great detective. There's only one thing we can make that with what we could find. What is it? A pickaxe! See, that's what I said. A pickaxe? Do you really think we can make it? We sh You would be surprised. Think about what we would need. Huh? Well... Keep in mind, only stuff we might find in this cave. What should we gather to make a pickaxe? Well, it needs a part to dig with. Exactly. Something pointing in heart. I'll keep my eyes peeled. Anything else we'll need? Yeah, we'll need a handle as well. Something that's straight and easy to hold. It should be long, too. It will have more center force and will be easier to dig with. I got it. Something long, straight, and easy to hold. Me! <laughs> This guy is really straight. <laughs> He's got good posture. Right, the last thing is something to tie the two parts with. A rope would be perfect. Okay, I got it. I'll look for those three things. Okay, so I know where like the first two items are, but string? I don't know. Rock! Uh, this one. It's supposed to be a piece of rock we dropped. It's really pointy. I bet we could use it. Sharp rock. Alright, and then there was a stick over here. A broken sign. Maybe we can use a stick. Yeah. Okay, so who has a string, huh? though? So there's hope for an escape after all. Um. About materials for a pickaxe. I'm thinking we can use hidden... Uh, we could widen the hole in the wall if we could make a pickaxe. Well, talk about imagination. I definitely wouldn't have thought of that. I'm looking for the parts. Do you have anything that we might be able to use? Hmm. I only brought my camcorder with me today. Maybe something useful is lying around here. Right, I'll have a look. Okay. Uh, do you have anything? We're trying to make a pickaxe to widen the hole in the wall. Do you have anything for it? Parts? You mean like a rock or something? Right, but we could use a handle and some rope. Let's see. Oh, how about my belt? I could. I think it could be useful. used instead of a rope. 
All right, so we got everything. Of course, I'm sorry to ask the, for it. It's thinner than my belt and would work better. Thank you very much. All right. So we got the materials. Hey, Tim. It's about time to open your case notes and think about this. All right. Case notes. Belt time. Make pickaxe. Let's look for materials to make a pickaxe. I did. Oh. Mm. I see. <laughs> Okay, so first pointy. I see. Belt. Nice. Stick. Do you think that's right? Yeah. That's nice. Your pickaxe is complete. Thank you. With that, we can tear down this wall. <laughs> we done it. Let's give it a shot. Yeah, and don't forget to give the belt back. Nah, I know. All right, let's go do it. Okay. Oh, I thought I was going to press a button. <laughs> Never mind. Nice. Now the wind is blowing from the hole. It looks like we finally be able to get out from here. But we didn't find any clues about where Dad might be, after all. Is that so? Don't think about it. Or, don't you think it's awfully strange and incident like this would happen at all? You mean, there's some cause behind Glalie going berserk like that? I don't know for certain, but there are too many odd points about this whole thing. Anyway, we should get out of here. Let's head back to where Amelia is. Yeah. What? Oh. oh. That hurt. <laughs> oh. He is just suffering. That's the second time he's fallen. Boop boop ba da be ba be ba be ba be ba boop. Look at this. Hey, How's Pikachu. It's what are you doing? Okay. Hurry up or it's gonna leave. Oh, sorry. Oh, what's this? Oh my god. Uh, what? Uh, 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 you know, you could have just told me you wanted to get up on my shoulders. <laughs> That's no fun. So, Driplem, we're counting on you. Drift? It's just huge. I thought Driftloon was bigger than that. We done it! The next day Pikachu invited me to come to the cafe with him. He said there's a place he always goes on the first floor of the building where the detective agency is. <gasps> Lolicolo! Hi Hat Cafe. Pablo, owner of the Hi Cat Cafe. Finally a break! Huh? The coffee is great here. Hey Pikachu! Oh! Do you two work together at the agency? No. Um, no. My name's Tim Goodman. I'm Harry's son. And it's, uh, nice to meet you. So you're Tim, huh? Well, I'm Pablo. Hi. Hi. Ludicolo here is our waitress. Jesus what? Christ. Come on, Ludicolo. You can't greet someone properly with coffee cups still on your head. Hello. Hmm. <laughs> Carefree waitress. Oh, it's a lady. So, any news about Harry? No, they still haven't found anything. Uh, well that's Harry. <laughs> I'm sure he'll pop up unexpectedly someday. Yeah, I'm sure you're right. Here you are. Thank you, Pablo. Pikachu, need milk or sugar? Nah, no thanks. Mm, this coffee smells so good! Mm. Oh. Oh, you're right. Delicious. I know. Ah, it has the best aroma. As well as pleasant acidity, along with the bitterness and balanced body. Once right. you drink this, you won't be able to go to other cafes. Mm -hmm. You know, my dad loved coffee, too. You're liking that way. 
<laughs> oh, wow, this music. Oh my god, it has layers to it. <laughs> I'm trying to find out more about the incident that caused by Pokemon. I hear they're increasing. Is this a report for school or something? You should watch GNN News. They always have a scoop on something. They must have a very good staff. GNN, the company Amelia works for. Ba, ba, ba. Do you come to this cafe often? I do. I was a fan of Pablo's music, but his coffee is also really good. The original blend is the best. I hear that the second floor is a detective agency too. How mysterious! Uh, oh wait, there's more. Hmm? So, was Pablo famous? Mm, in a way, people in the know knew about him. Cool. I, I see blues out of the corner of my eye. He's doing something at the window. Hey. The Baker Agency... Detective Agency is on the second floor about the cafe, right? So, Harry used to stop by a lot. I knew he had a son, but I didn't know you were so big. Harry looked young. My mom always called him immature. Haha, <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, where do you think my dad is now? Well, maybe somewhere he can smell the aroma of coffee. You're pr probably right. He's probably drinking coffee somewhere. Do you come to the city to look for Harry? Yes. I see. I miss Harry too. I hope you'll find him soon. Ludicolo is the waitress, right? Yeah, I let her help out just to see how she would do, and she really seemed to like the work. Has the cafe, uh, cafe, cafe been here for a long time? Well, we just passed two years here. I used to play the piano. You were a musician? Yeah, yeah but that's a long time ago now. Pikachu apparently loves a coffee blend at this cafe. I'm glad to hear it. A cafe's blend is like the face of the business. Hoodie. Well, if it isn't that girl everybody comes to see. <coughs> You're looking well today. Girl? It's a she? I mean, he did say she. <laughs> hey, Tim, don't be rude to the lady. Pablo just said she was a waitress. Yeah, see? Sorry. You weren't paying attention. It was delicious as always. Woody. I'd love to stay and have another cup, but there's somewhere I gotta go. Alright. A standard drink and drinks I've never seen before. That's the kind of selection I expect from Pablo. Cool. That's Pablo's collection. He's got records from all the great jazz musicians over the years. Is Pablo's piano. He doesn't play anymore, but he lets young musicians perform here a few times a week. That's neat. Hello, hello. I guess it's not turned on. Were you planning on singing? No way. I just say I saw the mic and got the urge to test it out. Are we heading out now? I guess. Well then, settle, settle to the tap. Thanks, that was delicious. Sure, come back soon. Well, let's head back home. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, oh hello, Tim. Headed somewhere? Um, uh... More Pokemon incidents are going on. Be careful out there. Oh, uh, okay. Thank you. Welcome, <laughs> Mr. Baker. Huh. Hmm. Pikachu never used to drink coffee before the accident. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. Wink, wink. Say no more. As I predicted, a strange incident occurred in the cave. Hmm. But we didn't find any clues about my dad. <sighs> That's true. But this might be worth looking into. The fuck is that? What is it? Well... I don't know exactly. Okay, cool. Maybe a broken vial. But why would something like that be in a cave, you know? Wait a second. Look at the shape. Doesn't it look familiar? 
See? You're right. The shapes are similar. Hmm. If this is part of a vial, then pharmacies and hospitals might be suspect. Also, research facilities, too. The blues. Pikachu. Even if we only checked hospitals, it'd take forever. Yeah, you're right. So we need to narrow it down even more. Oh, hey, Tim. Can you do me a favor and mark down where Harry got into his accident? Sure. <laughs> I think it was around here. <sighs> this has been bothering me for a while now. Hear me out. The accident was someplace not even close to the marked areas on the map. So why does that matter? Well, try matching it up with the map of Rhyme City. I just realized in the background, the pencils, I hate oh. how they're positioned because that's so easy to poke yourself. Now you see what I mean? I think Harry had his accident on his way back from this place. Hmm, you could be right. We should investigate this place next. And we'll do that next time. <laughs> Continue playing. No, we're ending it here. So uh, next time will be, I believe, chapter three. So until then, see you later, bros. I gotta feed my cats. <laughs>